Well, that was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in Prem. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were talking about some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you? They said they'd be heading through Nipton to Novak to meet a contact there. Hello again. I don't suppose you've decided to help Prim find its next sheriff? Oh, no. I'm just a deputy, and I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over us. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who has some experience as a sheriff. He may be a good choice. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure why they haven't helped out already. You will? That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the interview. The sheriff that was incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound so fun.
Look at you. Walking in here like you're one of us. Don't you know this is Powder Ganger territory? That's us. We got sent here to fix the rails and make some new ones. And for that, we got to use dynamite. Of course, dynamite works pretty good against caravan guards, too. So, that's what we do. Rob and blow things up. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> 